in today's tutorial i'm gonna be showing you how to make a 2d but a 3d look rotating christmas ball inside of after effects so guys this is randy from Ranzi graphics and welcome back to my after effects tutorial channel and without any further ado i'll show you what we are gonna be making today As usual I will create a new composition and I will name it image placeholder 1. Nineteen twenty by 1080 p 30 frames per second 25 seconds duration click ok. Right away I will go to my project assets open it up go to image I will drop down this image on my timeline. Right away, I'll go to effects and preset and go to perspective. I will apply CC sphere on it and I will go right away to the rotation. I will create a keyframe here by hitting the stopwatch to create an animation and move my player to the end of my timeline. Change this value here to about 3. I will go here and enable title action save. I will press on my keyboard P for the position and shift s for the scale i will change the scale here to about 50 percent and i will just drag it down i think that should be good enough so as you can see now as we scrub our playhead it looks like a 3d so we'll close this one and i will go back to my project panel and i will drag down my gold ground here just below the image png I will right away go to effects and preset, go to perspective and CC cylinder. I'll right away open the rotation and create an animation on the Y position. So hit the stopwatch in here to create a keyframe and move my playhead to the end of my timeline. Change this value here to negative 3. I will also go back to the image and open the light options. I will make the light height to 100% again go back to gold crown press p on my keyboard for the position and shift s for the scale i will disable this scale proportion here and change the x value to about 8 and the y value i will change it to 2 and i will drag it down on top of my ball go to layer create a new solid and i will name it string 1920 by 1080p and the color is white click ok i will drag it down just below my gold crown go to effects and preset perspective cc cylinder i will press p on my keyboard for the position and shift s for the scale disable the scale portion here and i will change the x position to about 0.2 i will change this y position to about 20 also rotate this string Hit the stop button on the Y rotation, change this value here to negative 3. And move your playhead at the beginning of the timeline, make this 0. So now I'm gonna go to composition again and create a new composition and I will name it ball 1. 1920 by 1080p, 30 frames per second and 25 seconds duration. I will click OK and drop down this image placeholder 1. So now I will create a new folder and I will name it Christmas Ball 1. And then I will highlight these compositions and put it on my Christmas Ball 1 folder. And I will again create another new folder I will name it Christmas Ball 2. I will open the Christmas ball one and highlight these two compositions. Go to edit, duplicate it, drop it down to my 
Christmas ball to folder. Then double click your mouse to open it up. Press your keyboard out and hold it. Go to your project panel and find the images that you want to use to replace the older image. Open the ball to composition and I will go to effects control. Change the rotation. I will go my playhead to the end of my timeline. Press U on your keyboard to see the keyframe. I will change this to negative 2. And also the gold crown. I will change the rotation here from negative 3 to positive 2. And the string. I will also change the rotation here from negative 3 to positive 2. So I will go to ball 2, highlight this image placeholder 1, I will go to my project panel and drop down this image placeholder 2. But before that, press your keyboard out and hold it, replace the image placeholder 1 by image placeholder 2. So now as you can see, when we play this one, the rotation is in different direction. So now I will again create another new folder and I will name it Christmas ball 3. Highlight this ball too and duplicate it. I will drag it down to my Christmas ball 3 folder. Open my Christmas ball 3 folder and double click my mouse to open it up. I will go to image, highlight this image, press Alt on your keyboard and hold it. Drop down this image to replace the images too. Go to effects and control panel. Open rotation. Move your playhead at the end of your timeline. Press U on your keyboard to see the keyframes. Change the Y rotation to 2. Gold crown, open the rotation and change the rotation Y to negative 2. Also the string, open the rotation and change the Y rotation to negative 2. Let's see when we play this one, the direction again goes to here but it's slower, okay? So now I'm gonna go again to composition and create a new composition. I will name this composition as Christmas Balls. Nineteen twenty by ten eighty p, thirty frames per second, and twenty five seconds duration. Click OK, and I will open my project panel. Drop down this ball one, ball two, and ball three. I will just drop down the ball one in between the ball two and three. I will highlight it all, press P on my keyboard for the position, move the second ball here. So the other one, so I have to go back to ball 3, highlight this placeholder 2, press on my keyboard alt and hold it, replace the placeholder 2 to image placeholder 3. So I will go back to Christmas balls again and now there you go, drag this ball up and maybe I will move it on the right side a bit and also the other one let's try to play it so now this is what we made Grab the text tool and type, it is not how much material you give. Using Times Roman font, 48 pixels. Drag this on this side, I guess. Duplicate this one. And put it on the other side. I will double click my mouse to change the text. I will highlight both of these layers. Press T on my keyboard for the opacity. Probably move to 2 seconds. I will change the opacity here to 0. Hit the stopwatch in here to create a keyframe. Move my play to about 4 seconds. Change this to 100%. Here I will change this to 0. And hit the stopwatch in here to create a keyframe. And move my play to about 6 seconds. 
and I will change this to 100% so now I'm gonna go to layer and create a new solid I will just change this to black and I will name it star field 1920 by 1080p and the color is black click ok I will drag this down at the bottom I will go right away to effects and preset find simulation CC particle world right away I will open the particle change the color to light yellow the red I will change it to bluish and I will change the particle type to star and then change the bird size to about 0.005 the dead size 0 0.005 and I will go to physics I want this velocity to be 0 also the gravity I want this 0 extra I want it 0 I will open the producer change the radius x and y here the longevity I will change this to 15 So when we scrub our playhead, this is what we got. We now have a star field. So now I will just enable this visibility here. So now I will add some more elements on it to spice up our project. I will go to project panel. I will drop down this starling into my timeline. I will right away pre-compose it. Move all the attributes into the new composition click ok and I will change the blending mode here to add I will highlight first and go to effects and preset color correction curves I will change this to blue and drag this blue up again change this to red and drag down the red change this to alpha drag it down I will disable the title action save so that it's easier for us to see okay and then I will go back to my project panel Merry Christmas footage drop it down to my timeline and move this layer to up here right click my mouse and enable time remapping expand this layer up to the end of my timeline and then I will right click my mouse again and pre-compose it move all the attributes into the new composition click ok change this blending mode to add I will press S on my keyboard for the scale and shift P for the position I will change the scale probably 50% drag this to the right side and I will drag it up a bit and go to effects and preset generate fill I will change this color to about orange so I will just type the code FB5301 click OK also this text here I will highlight this both pre-compose it move all the attributes into the new composition click OK go to effects and preset generate fill I'll just copy the fill here We'll try to preview it. Nice. So all we have to do now is to go to layer, create a new solid. I will name it fade in. And I will click OK. I will drag this up to the topmost. Go my play at about two seconds. And split the layer. Highlight this the bottom. Click T on my keyboard for the opacity. Make this to zero and create a keyframe. Move your playhead at the beginning. Make it a hundred percent. Move your playhead probably at twenty-two seconds. And again split the layer you delete this one because we don't need this one anymore and press T on your keyboard for the opacity hit the stopwatch in here to create a keyframe change this to zero then move your playhead at the end of the timeline and make it 
so now when we preview this one You can now add your music in here if you want to but for the sake of this tutorial I don't want to add it for now I'm just showing you how I created it we'll close this folder and I will create a new folder I will name it comps I will highlight these compositions and put it on the comps folder then I will go to composition and create a new composition and I will name it final 1920 by 1080p 30 frames per second and 25 seconds duration click ok then I will drop this Christmas balls let's try to preview it so guys our tutorial is done and i hope that you enjoy my video don't forget to subscribe and hit the thumbs up button to like it and don't forget to press the notification bell so that you will be notified on all the videos that I'm gonna be uploading in the coming days okay so my thoughts for today is that if you really want to have a success career in life continue learning at the end you will realize that learning is a vital role in achieving your goal thank you very much for watching and see you next time god bless